Alrighty, we are here. Let's go inside. People will be joining us. What's going on, guys? It's Steve, Susanna, with Baby Marie, and today we are out at a Disney Character Warehouse, Vineland. We are somewhere that we haven't been in literally months. Months. It has been so long since we have been in here. Wow. Honey, when was the last time we came to Character Warehouse? I don't remember. A long time ago. It's got to be several months, right? And I think you guys probably have an idea why we haven't been here. Because of the price increases and, you know, they had had a virtual queue for so long, but the virtual queue seems to have fallen away. Because, well, there's just not a big demand to pay top dollar for old merchandise. But either way, <clears throat> let's look inside. Hello, Raymond. Hello, Otter Girl. Welcome, welcome, welcome. Welcome to the unexpected live stream out here at Character Warehouse Vineland. So if you guys want to see what's in here, let's check it out. Okay, here we go. What is this? This is a little Coco zip-up hoodie. It's $24.99. Hello, Michael. Uh, I hope I said that. Uh, Atrofit. Hope I said that correctly. Denise, everybody. Welcome, welcome, welcome to the Character Warehouse Vineland. Okay. Honey, they have a little Ray costume. <laughs> Look, they have a Ray costume with the Ray wig. Halloween totes. Susanna looks like she's looking at the little... Halloween shirt for baby girl. Wow, everything in here is new to me. I haven't looked, I haven't just had really much interest at all in coming over here because of the price increases. $14.99 for a little boo sequin shirt. There's a little pen set, marker set, or what are these, like markers, right? Buzz Lightyear, $14.99. Spider-Man one, $14.99. What'd you say? It's big for her. It is big, right? The little, how much is the race suit? A little Ray costume. $24.99. $24.99, okay. Guys, as always, please give the video a big old thumbs up. Really helps us out in the YouTube algorithm. Um, let's see, what do we got here? The Pirates League. What are, what's in this? Something? No. I don't even know what that's from. I'm not gonna lie. Tell Ralph the best account that Steve and Suzanne and Baby Marie say hello, Michael. What do we have here? Makeup? Look at this, honey. Nail polish, lipstick. Interesting. So, of course, you guys all know um, Disney, like every other company and everyone on earth right now is dealing with supply chain issues. So, supply chain issues are definitely wreaking havoc on Disney itself. And it's really hurting Character Warehouse. And the reason why is because merchandise is having to stay at the regular retail locations like, not Mouse Gear, Creation Shop, I should say, or world of disney and so forth it's having to stay there much 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 longer so there's not a rush to push that merchandise out and send it over here to the warehouse so i mean it's crazy i haven't been in here in months but a lot of the merchandise that's here is stuff that was here months ago right yeah. look like these bags the little unicorns all, all of these shirts these were here last time we were here it's amazing 14.99 14.99 14.99 Oh, this one's cute. Rapunzel one. Look, honey. The Rapunzel one, $14.99. Hello, Melissa. Everybody, welcome, welcome, welcome. Oh. Should we tell everybody what our plans are? Yeah. Huh? Yeah. Since you're holding a Disney Cruise Line jacket, I think that probably gives it away a little bit. Honey, where are we going on November 15th? Where are we going? Yeah, yeah, I mean, right? yeah, I'll turn this around for a second. Uh, hold on. Yeah, me, Susanna, and baby girl, we're going on our very first ever Disney cruise. We've never done a Disney cruise before. Yeah, We've done I'm Royal so Caribbean excited. a couple times, but our first time sailing with Disney. We're going to be doing the Disney Dream. Merry Christmas cruise. Very, Merry, very, very Merry, Merry Christmas, Christmas cruise. Something yeah. like this. So it's a Christmas <laughs> cruise. So sounds like it's going to be a lot of fun so yep. of course we'll be covering that november 15th it's a four night cruise out of port canaveral yeah. so very excited so we might have to grab some cruise line uh, outfits yeah <laughs> if we see <laughs> if we see something right will that fit me <laughs> i don't know if that'll fit i don't think that'll fit me but either way let's keep on uh let's keep on looking at the merchandise here's a little mermaid tea yeah, Denise, we are very excited, Kathy. Very excited. Like I said, never done a Disney cruise. Well, that's new. For us, it's new. It's, it's very sequiny. How much is it? 
Is it priced? Uh, Real price is $14.99. $14.99. down to $12.99. I'm just going to point them out. $14.99. This Star Wars. Is this a jersey material? Yeah, it's from Galaxy's Edge. It even says Galaxy's Edge on the tag. $14.99. Hello, Carmen. Welcome to the stream. $24.99. Unicorn little top is $14.99. Life's not boring when you're exploring. $14.99. Character autograph books are still here, 99 cents. All of this stuff is, this is a princess costume, 140. Uh huh. And then I have the Mulan costume as well. All of this stuff has like been here for so long. There's a little Castaway K top on it. See, to wear over your swimsuit. No, 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 this one. See, yeah, to wear so over your, good. is that yeah. fit, is that an adult size or what is it? No, this is youth size. It I is. Like Will it fit Sometimes you though? Extra yeah, I was going to say, to wear it's over a swimsuit. I'm so excited to go to Castaway K. I can't wait. Yeah. Never seen it. This one has been here too. Yeah, this has been here. It's not new. No. This one is not new. That's all been here too. I'm looking at the tops. All these tops have been here forever. And I guess this is why you don't need a virtual queue when the merchandise doesn't change. This little bag I haven't seen before. Look on it. Look like a little backpack for baby. Look. The sun makes me sparkle. What do you think of that? You can put a little backpack on her. They still have the character autograph books. Okay. Well, can she wear this? It's too big for her? No. Extra small is three to four years old. Uh-huh. The little shorts are cute. Minnie Mouse sequin pencil case, twelve ninety nine. Yeah. It, Kathy, it's a four night cruise. Four nights. We were originally going to do a three nighter, and I said, you know what? I said let's do four nights, a little bit longer. It'll be a you know extra day to really get a chance to enjoy it. Since it's our first time on a Disney cruise ship, I want to, I want to do everything. You know, I want to see everything. So. $9.99. Photograph frames are 99 cents. So look at these, honey. These are 10 bucks. Yeah. Jeez. Oh. Even Expensive. The, even 50 castle uh, magnet uh -huh. in the emporium is nine. Yeah, that's what I'm saying. It's expensive. It's very expensive. I don't know. I guess they're just trying not to rush this merchandise out of here. The small board magnet sets are 10 bucks. So how much were these? Did you see these? Are they priced? They're $9.99. Wow. Wow, wow, wow. Those are $9.99 magnetic bag clips. Jeez. Oof. I don't feel like I'm in a clearance store, you know, like a liquidation store. $14.99 for these. How much is that one? That's something. That's cute. Is it full price though? <laughs> $14.99. Wow. Oof. So here's the thing that, it, well, here's the thing that becomes an issue is if um, you're on vacation, is it worth coming to the character warehouse if you're on vacation right now? I don't know. I mean, the prices that you're paying, are you actually saving enough money to venture over here? Like these are $12.99, $9.99, $12.99, aqua shoes, $22.99. They are Speedo brand. I don't know. If I'm on my, if I'm on my vac, we have a Mike asking about dogs. Are there any indestructible Mickey dog toys? Huh. You know what, Michael? I will look. If I see something for a dog, let's see. Because usually they have some doggy merchandise, so I will look. In case if anyone's new on the stream, it's my first time back in the warehouse in months. I just haven't really been trying to get over here, first of all, with the virtual queue, which is pretty much falling by the wayside now. And with the price increases and the not, uh, the no rolling over or changing of merchandise, it's basically the same stuff. Those are $9.99? So this is our first time in here in months, so I'm just trying to soak it in and see if there's anything interesting or, and a lot of the merchandise I'm seeing is the same stuff that was here months ago. <laughs> These are $9.99. Are they not marked down at all? They just showed the regular price. $9.99, $9.99. Nightmare Before Christmas little VHS cassette notebooks. Those are $14.99. Regularly, they're $19.99. It's only $5 off. Yeah, sometimes 
Wow, the it's nothing. Like few dollars. Yeah. Must be indestructible. He's like King Kong, Mike says. They His think doggy. I know some stuff from here to the regular store because of the uh, supply chain. Yeah, they ha yeah, they've moved some stuff supposedly back to the regular retail stores to fill shelf space. That's what I was looking at, the little Speedo shoes. But what are the regular price? They're probably pretty expensive. Uh huh. Disney Cruise Line merchandise, a couple ornaments, picture frame ornaments, uh, photo albums. So the ornaments are $3.99. Well, that's not bad. Okay, $3.99 for those. These are $3.99 as well. Honey, these are $3.99. That's not bad for the ornaments. But they've had those for months too. These are $9.99. They got, a, they got a bunch of autograph books. Little posters are $9.99. The bag clips, Mickey Mouse little hand or glove bag clips, $5.99. Oh, These are 99 cents. Autograph books, maybe one day we'll need them again. You see flower and garden cups? Oh yeah, the tumblers. Yeah, three ninety nine. Okay. These are ten ninety nine. Uh huh. So ten ninety nine, three ninety nine. Let me see. It's like a. Got it. I don't want to drop it. Yeah. Those are three ninety nine. The little keychains are dollar ninety nine, seven ninety nine. That's like a little change purse. The buttons are three ninety nine. They've still got the art easels. Oof. Okay, let's go. Uh, yeah, I'll follow you. Let's go to the shirt wall or whatever. That's like a soccer jersey. Yeah. Why? That's interesting. That's even here. I'm not sure. Like 49. Yeah, but then why is that here? Where does Disney sell soccer jerseys? Well, I know they have the store at Disney Springs to sell soccer jerseys, but that's not owned by Disney. Hey, guys, do y'all know why, why Disney has soccer jerseys in here? I'm confused. And I always thought that this, um, the apparel store at Disney Springs that sells the soccer apparel, I always thought that was owned by you know, a private company. I didn't think that was Disney owned. Huh. That's a Coco t-shirt. I'd like to kind of take a look at some of the shirts to see what they're priced at. $14.99. See, like something like that used to be... Yeah, how much is it? Long sleeve? $12.99. See, like this one's a little high though, fourteen ninety nine. Something like this used to be like nine ninety nine, right? Yeah. Oh, that's true, Mike. I hadn't thought about that. You might be onto something with the European cruises, right? So, do they sell soccer apparel on those European cruises, or are you just teasing me? You might be teasing me, Mike. I can never tell with you. This one's nine ninety nine. Train whistles are seven ninety nine. Okay. They were a lot cheaper. I remember when they first brought them over here months ago because I bought one for like, I don't know, it was a dollar ninety nine or something like that. <clears throat> this is a cool little shirt, twelve ninety nine. A lot of NBA experience socks are here. Those are all eleven ninety nine. Rest in peace, NBA experience. <laughs> Nobody saw that one coming. Here's a bunch of cruise line shirts. These are all ring collar. What is it? Uh, the magic, the magic. So, yeah, from 2020. These have been around here for a while too, though. Really? Yeah, they've had these for a while. They're not new. The Donald Duck one. How much are they? Because usually DCL merch is a little higher. These are 14.99. The magic. The, the the Germany Pavilion sells Adidas stuff. Ah, well, okay. That's a cool shirt. I like that one. But it's only in a small. Um, World Show. Yeah, I think occasionally World Showcase merchandise does show up here. Off the top of my head, I can't think of it, but yeah, I think so. Sure. <clears throat> 
I think that just goes back to does Disney own the retail location inside of those pavilions? And uh, yeah, but I think I feel like I've seen World Showcase merch before. Hello, Debbie. We are doing well. How are you? You know what, Mike? I could, I could, I could fit a Mike's. I could fit a small. I could fit a small. It might be a little bit. Of a sh I might have to cut the back of the shirt open though. But I think I could wear it small. Just put like a little relief cut right on the back of the shirt, and I think I could squeeze into it. Look, honey, this is here, twenty nine ninety nine. This one here is uh, three quarter sleeve, nineteen ninety nine. Nineteen ninety nine. See, those all used to be like nine ninety nine. They've had these forever. These tie dye polos, nineteen ninety nine. Twenty twenty nine ninety nine for that one. Whew. Twenty four ninety nine. Twenty four ninety nine. Fourteen ninety nine. Nineteen ninety nine. Nineteen ninety nine. Pixar little raincoat yeah, windbreaker 34.99 so basically they've added 10 bucks to everything 1999 wow they've had these for so long 1999 24.99 now wow 1999 24.99 24.99 Debbie, I just saw in the chat. I'm so sorry to hear that. Oh, so sad. Oof. That's always tough. 1999, 1499, 1999, 1999, 2499, 4499 for the jersey. They still have jerseys. Still have the backpacks. So say they're 1999. And here's old Christmas merchandise. $4.99 for the tree trail from Disney Springs 2019. Tote bags are $7.99. The gloves are $7.99. Okay. Okay. Christmas tote is actually pretty nice. The uh, ABC trinket boxes, those are $12.99. Ah, everything's going back up. Men's Snow Dog Cufflinks. $200. So this is the jewelry. What do we have in here? Disney Dream Collection. Kathy, did I see you were saying about long sleeves? I'll keep an eye out to see if there's anything interesting long sleeve wise. For anyone new on the stream, welcome, welcome, welcome. We at Disney Character Warehouse of Vineland checking out what's here what's new it's been months since me and suzanne have been over here to this location or to character warehouse in general we just haven't been here in a while because the merchandise just isn't turning over very quickly and of course the prices have gone way up um supply chain issues wreaking havoc across <laughs> the disney um the disney character warehouse locations uh, it seems like the the main locate the regular retail locations inside of disney springs like world of disney disney style etc creation shop at epcot they're holding onto that merchandise as long as they can because they have nothing to replace it with they can't fill the shelves we saw it firsthand big time like at disney days of christmas at disney springs where um the shelves were basically like being filled in with just um stockings like christmas stockings they didn't have any ornaments no ornaments so oh that's a nice one huh how much is it oh my gosh no no well you see for that then i would just rather buy like off the ship huh. well i mean it's up to you oh look what they have here is this the, look the stitch hoodies yeah how much they do have it how much is it uh, look they have this stitch hoodie oh my gosh 29.99 for that can you hold the let me see the hat can you hold it look at this the stitch hoodie is here that's like a disney classic right that's a theme park disney classic that's funny do i want it no because it's too hot i would never wear it down here It'll just sit in the closet. It's very warm. Look, it's like thick fleece. But it's it's funny though. I've always thought that's like one of the funniest hoodies they make. And how much is it? I said I forgot. Twenty four ninety nine or twenty nine ninety nine. It's not bad. Yeah, that's not bad. That's half price. That's good. 
They do have the wallets, Minnie Mouse wallets for twelve ninety nine. Oh no, baby girl is she's up. Baby girl's awake. Rice Krispie treats. Rice Krispie treats. Guys, if you're new to the channel, do make sure to subscribe. That way you don't miss out on any of our super fun lives and videos as well. Um, give the video a big old thumbs up as well if you're enjoying it. I say it every time. It tells YouTube's algorithm that you're enjoying the Disney live. And that other people that like Disney would probably enjoy it too. So if you give it a big old thumbs up, really, really appreciate it. Plus you want to subscribe anyway because you want to be able to see all of our super cool vlogs from the Disney Dream here in a couple weeks for the Christmas cruise. I can't wait, super excited. And I will be documenting that cruise ship to my best ability. There'll be a lot of videos coming from the Disney Dream, so. Not live streams, unfortunately, because of internet, but a lot of videos, so. Don't want to miss those. What do we have here? We have Watto. Here we go. Mike, if you're there, they have a, they have a little, I don't think that's gonna fit your dog, but they've got a, what do you call that? A spirit jersey for a little puppy dog. It's too bad because for the longest time they had so much dog merchandise, pet merchandise. Yeah, nothing. I still have the little R2-D2 wristlet. Little Star Wars jersey in the tank top. What's over here? Pixar wallets. Those are $12.99. Pixar zip-up hoodies. Rainbow Mickey hats and the patches. Hats are $9.99. And more of the easel magnets. Okay. Huh. What's mixed in here? Yeah, I figured it'd be a little bit small. Is this from the Wilderness Lodge? It's just a plain jersey, huh? Interesting. Who's the manufacturer? Can I see the tag? Can I? No, but can I see the make? Like who makes this? Why? It's Disney. It's made for Disney, but it was never printed on. Interesting. Four ninety nine. See, that might not be a bad deal. I'll be honest with you, that's cheaper than I can get a hoodie for, a blank hoodie. <laughs> Interesting. It just never got printed on. Yeah, those are Disneyland jerseys. I think everything here is Disneyland. All of these. The coral is nice. How coral has become such a popular clothing color. You know what it is? Because people never thought or knew what coral was until recent, and now everybody wants coral shirts and everything. But I'm thinking that's from the Wilderness Lodge, if I was guessing. Disneyland jerseys, Disneyland jerseys. They have a lot of leggings. Did you see all the, it's blank too? $4.99 blank shirt. Huh, yes, look, it says right there, plain red navy women's shirts, $4.99. Interesting. Did you see the leggings? Oh, yeah. yeah. Balloon ones, the little pets. Mm -hmm. I don't know. Anything else you want to look at in here? <laughs> what is this bag? What is this bag? I don't know this bag. Owen Berry Distinctive. I don't know anything about this. It's $48.99. It's more than half price. The uh, totes from um, Ink and Paint. Yep. You're right, Mike. It would have been a dollar less. <laughs> Let's look at this. Well, here we go. Tons of treats. Rice Krispie treats. Those are all 99 cents. Tons of treats. A couple of plushes. Pin wise, what do we have? A couple of cruise line pins. Flower and garden pins, those are four ninety nine. It's all the same. That's how I was looking at. Did you, so you got a couple? Oh, Susanna got five yeah, Rice Krispie treats. Up to, 10. up to ten of those. So the limit. Yeah, because I heard they're each, not. Each of us. Yeah, they're not doing the limits on the perishables. So like sodas, anything. Y'all know what perishables are. Food. If you can eat it, you can buy more than two. <laughs> what you would think, like they should actually limit, because. It's, you should limit the things that people have to eat because then everybody would starve to death. One person bought it. <laughs> You're not going to die if you can't get an a ice cream keychain. Which, by the way, was $7.99. He said it was too small for his dog. He said, he said you'd have to buy two and sew them together for his puppy. $7.99 for these. They're all the same, though. Nothing's new for me. 
That's new. $8.99. That's from the NBA Experience too. Yeah, Disney NBA Experience keychains, eight ninety nine. Okay, different sport teams on this. It's around this way. Lanyards, Tinkerbell. This one's a keychain. Yeah, the Daisy Duck and the ice cream one. I was looking. Seven ninety nine. Seven ninety nine for the little change purses. Lots of Star Wars pins. Galaxy's Edge Black Spire Outpost. They can't give away the Black Spire Outpost merchandise. This Finn has been here for months. wado has been here for months. Lando's been here for months. Dio. Nobody wants Dio. R2D2 wristlets. Rice Krispie treats. The Matterhorn bobsled pops. They've been here forever. Over a year, <laughs> if I was guessing. Phone, even, what do we have phone case ones? Uh, they got the little 10, uh, iPhone 10 Mickey Mouse one. That's kind of nice. Very limited though, on the phone cases too. Anything else? A couple Star Wars things here. It's DVDs, a couple of those t-shirts I haven't seen. 9.99, is there something on the back of this? There is. Ah, oh, came off the hanger. Yeah. You want to hang it for me? I didn't get to see what was the print though. Luke, Sk you can get some more. What did it say on the back? Luke Skywalker Han Solo. Okay. Oh, Star Wars merchandise. Nobody wants you. Why? Who can tell me why nobody wants the Star Wars merchandise? Uh, right now. Yeah. Okay. Wow, Suzanne is checking out. I'll take a look on this end cap. What was over here? Elanov Avalor. The jewelry sets, little tiaras. More phone cases. Just wait over here for Suzanne to come out. Shall we? Don't drop your phone. More cell phone cases here at the front. Whew. All right. Well, that was the character warehouse. You guys saw what we saw. I don't know that it's kind of eh. It's kind of eh. I probably won't be back to this one right away or anytime super soon just because it's kind of just outdated merch. Um, it is what it is. The supply chains are screwing up everything. So I think that's the issue with character warehouse or Disney just figured out that they can just sell the merchandise in their stores. But no, I think it's just, I mean, look, they're, they sell out of the merchandise in the stores. So of course they're not going to bring the merchandise to you. So um, anyway, anything you want to add? Uh -huh. Did they uh, release uh, any new merchandise yesterday? Yeah. I haven't seen anything new get released. Yeah. I mean, they've been peppering little stuff in there, like the snow globes, the ornaments. A lot of that stuff sold out like that so toy, uh, the Skyliner. The Skyliner toy. That may be sold out by now already, too. So. Yeah. Um, no, but they haven't released a new series yeah, wait, Everybody they, is waiting. It got, pushed, it got pushed back, and who knows if it's going to get pushed back again. So yeah. It's just a weird time. I mean, you know. Disney's, Disney's not immune to getting merchandise from China either. It's not easy, so. But Character Warehouse, it is what it is, so. You would just think that, like, if the merchandise is this old and it's been sitting, that maybe they would lower the prices a little bit. Somebody on their one-hour video, uh, she said that some rumors, they, they said that they are going to close. Through. I mean... I'll believe it if, if I see it from Disney somewhere, but yeah. I think, uh, look, here's the thing, I've, I've seen this rumor pop up a lot that Character Warehouse is going to close, 
But a lot of people got very confused. It's not Character Warehouse that was closing. It was the Disney stores in their local towns and that type of thing. I don't think Character Warehouse is going anywhere mm -hmm. right away. Because if Disney wanted to close Character Warehouse, they would do it tomorrow. Yeah. Like, why would they wait? Uh, why would they keep it open now? They don't have to. They could just close it right away and not deal with the holidays either. Who wants to deal? Why would they deal with the store in the holidays? I would close it. Now, October, they should shut it down. If, if Character Warehouse is open on November 1st, then I don't think you have to worry about it going anywhere anytime soon. If it's on November 1st, yes, Disney packed it up and moved out. Possible? I've always said why Disney just doesn't sell their merchandise on sale at World of Disney or even having an on-site store. Although if you had an on-site store at Disney Springs, can you imagine how crowded that store would be? At least over here, you have to be determined to come over here to do shopping right like it's not like you can just board a disney bus and come over here you got an uber or have a rental car or live here so no i don't think it's going anywhere anytime soon that's just my opinion but it's just don't get your hopes up for a lot of new merchandise in november december that's my opinion i think most people would probably agree with that too do your christmas shopping early I've been saying that for months. It's affecting our business that we run, our online business. I struggle every day to find my merchandise that I need for my business. Disney's not immune to it. Now, Disney does have the ability to charter you know, planes and fly planes into China to, you know, to bring cargo out, but they can't speed up the offloading of cargo containers that have been floating in the Pacific Ocean for months. They don't have a way to get their cargo containers off those ships any faster than anybody else. They could theoretically send aircraft to pick up merchandise and bring it. I don't think they're going to do that anyway. I don't think that it's that big of a deal to them. So anyway, I could go on and on about this type of stuff. But guys, that's Character Warehouse Vineland. I hope y'all enjoyed the video. Make sure to subscribe, thumbs it up. You guys know what to do. Um, anything else you want to say before we close the live? No, nothing. All right, we'll see y'all. We, we will go, uh, continue our shopping. Yeah, we're going to do a little, yeah, we're going to do some personal shopping. Stevie needs shoes. Baby girl needs some stuff. Susanna needs some stuff. But we at least wanted to share the warehouse with you guys. So anyway, take care. Have a great one. We'll see you in the next video. Thank you. Bye, everyone. Have a great one.